All right, check it out, y'all, man. Lavelle Motor Works back with another one. Y'all check it out, man. I've been rolling. I ain't been playing lately, man. Right here, y'all, we got a CBR. Uh, uh, I think that. I forget what that say. Uh -huh. You know, I don't know how to read and write because all I know how to do is build motors. But anyways, we got 99 CBR 600. This bike is still carbureted. Now, this guy came to me. He said, hey, man, Lavelle Motor Works, check this out. He said, I'm only 5'7". But I got to stand on my tippy toes when I'm at the red light. I'm trying to deliver pieces on my bike. And I'm going to have a book bag on with pieces. And I want to go ahead and be comfortable on the bike. I said, all right. So what I did was I measured the distance between the ground and his waistline. Okay. After I measured the ground and the waistline, he wanted his feet planted on the ground when he get ready to stop. I measured the distance between the ground and the waistline of his bike, which is the seat. And basically, I had to align those two. And I ended up dropping the bike four inches. So what I did was I put a lowering kit on this bike and I drilled holes in it where I wanted that. Now I dropped the front about two and a half inches in the front of the compression. So then that way the bike can kind of even out. You don't want the bike to sway as well or anything like that. But if y'all ever need this done, you're too tall or you're too, you, you, you're too short and you want your bike lowered or you want it to, you know, hit, sit a little higher, y'all hit me up, man. I'm the guy for it, man. Y'all hit me up. Lavelle Motor Works, and I'm back with another one. Y'all have a good day. I've been running through 15 to 20 bikes a week. I love y'all. Thank God for everything, and stay blessed out there. Y'all have a good one.